children, Franz? Not yet, sir. Georg, those mountains, they're magnificent. Yes, they're not like any other mountains. They're friendly. Look, that green stretch of woods over there. When the wind moves through it, it's like a restless sea. And that sweet little village. That's not a village. That's a town. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt its feelings. You know, it's fun being with you. You're quite an experience for me. You're quite an experience for me, too. Somewhere in you, there's a fascinating man. Occasionally, I catch a glimpse of him. And when I do, he's exciting. Exciting? I've never been called exciting before. I'm beginning to understand you better now that I see you here. You know, you're a little like those mountains. Except that you keep moving. How can you be away from this place as much as you are? Maybe I've been searching for a reason I've come back here to stay. Georg, I like you here very much. Max can't still be on the telephone. I know he's desperate about getting singers for the Kaltzberg Festival, but... You like it here? Oh, we'd have to spend some time in Vienna. I have Heinrich's estate to look after. I thought that was a corporation now. It is. And I'm president. You, president of a corporation. After all, I managed Heinrich's affairs for years before he died. I can't see you sitting behind a desk. <laughs> well, of course I wear business suits and smoke a big cigar. I'm sorry I took so long. Any luck? How would you like this for the Kaltzberg Festival? The finest singing group in Austria, the greatest mixed quartet in Europe, and the best soprano in the world. Max, that's something I'd love to hear. So would I. All I've got up to now is a basso who is in even profundo. <laughs> Max, you always come up with a good festival concert. And why? Because my motto is, never start out looking for the people you wind up getting. That's why I've been telephoning Paris, London, Stockholm, Rome. On Georg's telephone. How else could I afford it? Why am I up here? Well, I hoped it was because you liked me. <laughs> of course I like you. Why shouldn't I like you? You live like a king. You have an excellent wine cellar. Max! I like rich people. I like the way they live. I like the way I live when I'm with them. <laughs> Georg, speaking as a government official, I would just like to... Georg, is there a cathedral around here? That's our abbey, Nunberg Abbey. Do they have a choir? I think so. Great, because over the next few days, I have to travel to all these small towns around here to listen to the choirs, quartets. You'll be here for meals, won't you? Oh, yes. <laughs> it was a town just about this size, Watsman, where I discovered the St. Ignatius Boys Choir. In 1930, they won the festival, became very famous, traveled all over the world. Oh yes, whatever became of them? By the time their voices changed, they were rich enough to live in America. <laughs> Georg, who lives in that dilapidated castle over there? Rumpelstiltskin? Baron Elberfeld, the oldest family in the valley. I'd like to meet him. I'd like to meet all your friends here. Georg, why don't you give a dinner for me while I'm here? Nothing very much, just something... Lavish. I wouldn't know whom to invite. Today it's difficult to tell who's a friend and who's an enemy. This isn't a good time to make enemies. Let's make some friends. I can't understand what's happened to the children. You're not worried about them, are you? They should have been here to welcome you. Well, it couldn't have been an intentional slight. They haven't even met me yet. Forgive me, I'll try to find them. Elsa, have you made up Georg's mind yet? Is he going to marry you? Oh, yes. Of course, he just hasn't admitted it yet. There seems to be something standing in his way. You don't know what it is? No. I do. <laughs> what? It's simple. It's money. Money? Yes. He's rich, and you're rich. In all the famous love affairs, the lovers have to struggle. In yellow rooms away upstairs, the lovers starve and snuggle. Their famous for misfortunes, which they seem to have no fear of. While lovers who are very rich, you very seldom hear of. No little shack do you share with me. We do not flee from a more country. How can love 
Die like Camille for you. 